There was this moment in the speech. I want to hear the full explanation, but I don't really disagree with you. Have a look at this. We can go to Australia, which has now become one of the wokest places on earth. Do explain, sir. Well, yes, I think Sydney and Melbourne are amongst the wokest places on earth. I mean, after all, when I was with you just a couple of months ago, you know, the New South Wales Police demanded a ransom <laughs> for me to give a speech in case my words left anybody feeling unsafe. I mean, what the blooming hell's going on? A friend of mine in Sydney sent me a video, I'll pass it on to you, of a drag queen reading stories to three-year-olds. Wow. I came up against some protesters from Sydney University. I mean, I've got to tell you, they seemed almost deranged. And you've only got to look at Melbourne, which actually became the most locked down part of the whole world. Um, I'm sorry if I'm offending your sensibilities, dear boy, <laughs> but I do think you've got a bit of a, a bit of a problem in those two cities. I really do. <laughs> you know I've got the height of a rhino. It's all good. Uh, the Deputy Lord Mayor of Melbourne is also on our show right now, so he'll respond to all of this in a moment or two's time. But thanks for the shout-out and the content. I appreciate it.